Oh, what's up, everybody? Now, this is Undertaker, you know, history and facts that I didn't even know until now. Like, I didn't know The Undertaker was a Paul Heyman guy after all these years. Never researched it, never knew about it. Back in, like, 1990, when Paul Heyman was his manager and he was known as Mean Mark, I think it's very interesting knowing that The Undertaker had rivalries with Paul Heyman's client, Brock Lesnar, for years, <laughs> you know? It's like, Paul Heyman guys fight Paul Heyman guys. And, honestly, a lot of Paul Heyman guys were failures. Kinda. I mean, Curtis Axel, no. Cesaro, no. Heidenreich, no. <laughs> people like that. Then you have people like The Undertaker and Brock Lesnar, who are very successful wrestlers, who at least made their money's worth in the WWE. But it's just funny looking back that The Undertaker was a Paul Heyman guy. I just think it's interesting because I had no idea, so... Give me a break. I never really got into that. And apparently, The Undertaker, me, Mark, faced Sting in WCW 1990. This was not when The Undertaker was an established wrestler. This was not when The Undertaker was The Undertaker. It was when he was Mean Mark, or whatever his name was in WCW. It might have still been Mean Mark. I don't know. But they had a match. He had a match against Sting. I'll have a link below with the highlights of the match you can look at. But, um, but yeah, I just didn't realize that The Undertaker faced Sting. It's happened before. Kinda. And that Paul Heyman was his manager. Just had no idea. There's just some wrestling facts for you guys. And that's all I want to say. Have a nice day. Subscribe if you want to. And bye.